Welcome to Aptitude Destination. Please pause the video and read the question completely. What is the middle term of the sequence Z, Z, Y, 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 X, 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 X and so on till A? If you notice the first term repeats itself for two times, the second for three times, the third letter for four times and so on. So these numbers is going to go on for 26 times because there are 26 letters in the English alphabet. So we can assume that n is equal to 26. But please notice that the sequence is not starting from 1. Therefore, let's add a 1 here and from the answer, we can subtract that 1 later. So now this will make n is equal to 27. Now we can use the formula which we used to find the sum of first n natural numbers. That is n into n plus 1 by 2. And do not forget to subtract that 1 which we added for this purpose. Now substituting 27 in the place of n, we get 27 into 28 by 2. Cancelling these out, we get 27 into 14 minus 1, that is 378 minus 1, that is 377. Now we have found out the number of terms, that is 377. To find the middle term, let's divide 377 by 2, that will give us 188.5 which means we have 188 terms on either sides of the middle term. Therefore, 189th term would be the middle term. Now to find out which alphabet is occupying 189th position, we'll have to add these up until we get a sum of 189. It is important to remember that we added this one on purpose just to make it easy for us to use the formula n into n plus 1 by 2. Therefore, subtract 1 from that formula. Solving these, we get n into n plus 1 by 2 equals 190. n into n plus 1 equals 380. And the quadratic equation n squared plus n minus 380 equals 0. Now we have to find a product that gives minus 380 and the sum that gives 1. Let's factorize 380 to make it easier. So factorizing 380 with 4, we get 95. Factorizing 95 with 5, we get 19. Therefore, 19 into 20 gives 380. The product is minus 380, but the sum is plus 1, which means the greater value has to be positive. Therefore, n plus 20 into n minus 19 equals 0. The values for n are minus 20 and plus 19. Minus 20 is not possible. Therefore, the 19th letter in the reverse order of the alphabet sequence would be our answer. So writing the alphabet sequence in the reverse order, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19th letter would be H. Therefore, option A is the right answer.